You want some more chicken, huh? It's nice. You've done so well, baby. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Hey guys, so this vlog is so exciting um, because if you guys have been following um, my social media, you will see that about six weeks ago, I adopted a dog from Romania called Freddy. And um, it's finally come to the time where he will be arriving. Uh, I'm currently just watching, we've got a big group on um, Facebook Messenger of seeing where all the dogs are at the moment. They're going to different drop-off points up the country. Um, I am drop off number nine. Uh, so he, they are on drop off number four at the moment. So I don't think it'll be too much longer, but it literally could be like six o'clock in the morning or I don't know. I've got to go on to Google Maps now and try and figure out where he's at, how long it's going to take them to go to the different places. Um, but the people who are looking after him are professionals. Um, they're really, really good at transporting dogs uh, they're getting loads of water, loads of checks, getting fed, um, lots of love as well. And they've been basically sending us little videos of them traveling, um, just yeah, letting us know that they're all okay. So it's really exciting. Um, and now it's literally just biding my time until he arrives. Like I said, I'm not sure what time it will be. Um, I do have training at 7.30 in the morning, which could be interesting, but... Uh, well, we'll just see, won't we? We'll be fine. Um, I think if he arrives close to that, I'll probably just ring mum and say, do you want a lesson on Eagle? Um, and also ask Callum just to ride Will for me this time, just because it's one of those rare occasions, isn't it? It doesn't happen all the time. Um, and then just settle him in, really, uh, because I don't want to travel him um, to my parents yet until he's kind of decompressed from travelling over here. But yeah, that is basically what's going on. Um, I will tell you the story of why I got him um, later on, probably when he's here. But yeah, I'm so excited. Hey guys, um, so there's not been many updates. It's actually uh, half six on Friday. The last video I made was on Thursday. Um, so it's been a bit of a nightmare. Um, Nobody's fault, but it has been a nightmare. Uh, so, yeah. Um, van one, which is the van my dog's in. Um, Freddie was meant to be here at 11 o'clock today, but it got stuck in... There was an accident, um, and it got stuck for ages. And then the road was closed, so they had to reroute. Um, so, yeah, his. Uh, I had a new ETA for him, and it was 8 o'clock tonight. Um... But I'm not even sure it's going to be then. Uh, it's just really difficult to know where they are and what's going on because there's so many dogs, so many owners. Um, the people who are travelling are obviously driving and like resting and stuff. So it's just, it's really difficult. And I've been so stressed all day um, about him arriving and I'm just worried about him. But uh, they are looking after them really well on the journey and hopefully it won't be that long. So I'm... <laughs> I don't know what to do with myself. I'm just trying to like buy the time. Um, yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just, uh, I'm just praying that he gets here soon so that he can rest, eat, sleep, chill, have cuddles. Um, so yeah, I will, I'll update you when I know some more. So I've actually been painting at home. We're painting our stables. That's why I look this color, um, but other paint has arrived which is uh, for my bedroom so I might I might just start doing it to like distract myself is that really weird I don't know where I'm going to sleep though if I start doing that I just need to find something to do but um yeah I got this is where I get my paint it's a little bit more expensive um but it's so good and you don't need as much uh and it's also gorgeous colours um, so this one is a pink, uh, it's called Helleborn, 
Well, let's go see what it looks like. Oh, look at this paint. Oh, it's so nice. Yeah, I'm gonna do a bit of this because I need distracting. Oh my God, it's so good. Oh. Ugh. It's so nice. Oh my God. I feel like such a rebel, um, just starting to paint a wall. I don't know why. My house. It's my house, ladies and gentlemen. Let's put a light on. Oh my God, it's gonna be so pink. <laughs> oh no, is it gonna be too intense? I'm worried now, I always do this. I start doubting myself. You know, when you pick something that's quite out there, you're like, what? what? Oh, what if it's gonna be too much? Is it too much? Oh gosh. We'll soon find out, hey. I guess I can paint over it. It's because nobody's ever painted this house, so everything's like, what's it called? Magnolia. That's the word. That's the word. Just keep distracting yourself, Olivia. Just keep painting. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, right, anyway, I'm gonna paint a bit more and then I'll film. Okay, I know I said I would just do a little bit. Is my phone ringing? Is it ringing? It's vibrating. Oh. Hello. Yeah. I'm vlogging. You're doing what? Vlogging. Hi. Hi, hi everyone. Hi everyone. Hi everyone. This is my best I'm friend, just, everyone. I'm just trying to put my hair up. How are you? I'm fine. I was just I'm showing my wall. Huh? I was calling to check on you because you sound all sad. I am really sad. Freddy's on his way. I know, but I'm really stressed out that he's been there so long. So I wanted to do Freddy a little sign, right? Because I was painting. I was like, why not? And I started to write welcome and I missed out the C. I mean, who does that? But anyway, I put it above there, but I couldn't fit Freddy in. So we put Fred. How oh, sweet. Let me show you. Hey guys, uh, another update. So um, they are five minutes away from Cardiff. Okay, and we are the next stop after Cardiff. So um, if all goes smoothly, then he should he be here by like 10, 15. Um, and then I'm gonna give him so much love, so many cuddles. <sighs> okay, so um, the Cardiff drop off's been done, so I'm hoping he's on his way over here, but I haven't heard anything. I've messaged a lady who had so just had a dog and no. she said that they did leave. Know. So I'm just hoping that he's on his Tom's way. I have painted you. so much. Eventually I'm hoping it'll be business as usual. That's not a threat, right? No. It's just an <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so he's definitely next stop so I'm getting dressed and ready. Okay, crew, he's three minutes away. <laughs> I'm probably not gonna film actually getting him out because I don't want him to escape. So next thing you'll see is me bringing him in.
done it and then I'm gonna film some more. so proud of you I'm so proud of you I am you can keep having some chicken good boy good boy come here baby good boy you're doing so well want some more chicken oh good boy good boy um so I'm come here baby you're doing so well. Hold on. Um, this is the most nerve wracking thing. Are you okay? You look a bit wobbly. I hope you're just tired. petrified that he's not okay. He's all wobbly on his back legs but I think he's tired. <sighs> um, if this is not enough, like I, I can't believe, like if this doesn't make you want to adopt a dog, what, wait for our partnership to build. Come here. If this isn't enough to make you want to adopt a dog, I don't know what it is because these poor animals just do not understand like homes and life. Come here. I think you're doing really well. Well baby I know it's gonna be really hard. You do so well. Um, so I'm going to sleep downstairs tonight on the sofa and um, stay with him. I think he's happier down here. He hasn't been upstairs yet and it's 12 o'clock and I don't kind of want to give him too much to do. Um, he's still really cautious of me. I sat on the sofa and like held him for a little bit and he's just very nervous when I touch him. Um, so I'm just giving him enough time. Uh, not kind of pressuring him, leaving him to get used to the house and all that sort of stuff. Um, so yeah, I'll keep you updated uh, with what's going on. But I literally love him so much. Good morning, everyone. Um, hi, Annie. <laughs> hi. Um, I'm just going to try and take him outside for a wee. Maybe little poopy. Come on, then, let's go. Good boy. Come on, then. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Good 
going back to your food. Are you going back to your food? So we went back to bed for a little bit because we were both tired. Oh, oh, he says I'm exhausted. Do you want to go for another little poopy because you keep farting? <laughs> oh, he says yes. Oh, yes, I like this bed. Also, he's literally like Instagram famous already. It's brilliant. Um, it's, uh, it's seven. Yeah, 7.30 now. Um, I took him out at six. And throughout the night, I got up to check him quite a lot because um, he actually sat downstairs and I sat upstairs because I thought he'd want some peace. Um, and then when I was upstairs, I could hear he was having a little walk around um, getting some food, having some water. And I thought it would be nice for him just to have some space. Um, I was quite nervous because he was doing this thing where he's quite heavy breathing or like panting, he's doing it now. Um, but I remember when I got Lulu, she did that and I think it's where they're not used to being in a house So I'm just gonna keep the windows open um, And I think yeah, they just as well with the stress of traveling um, And just the different stuff. I messaged the people um, the rescue center and just said Is it okay? Is it normal? And they were like, yep, yeah, that's fine um, Just obviously keep an eye on him, but it's a big journey for them um, which I'm going to talk about later. Oh, oof. anyway, I look like an absolute mess. But um, yeah, I'm going to take him out again. So. Yes. Come up here. Come on, you got this. Oh. 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 Come here then. Come on. Do you want me to pick you up? Oh, ready? Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, this Are you itchy? Do we need a bath? Do we need a bath? Oh, I think we need a bath. Are you gonna hate me? Now, I don't want our relationship to be ruined straight away, but you look a bit itchy. Oh yeah, it says that feels nice. Are you gonna have a mad half an hour now? Good boy, Freddy. Oh, he's so good. So good, huh? Yeah. Oh, good boy, Freddy. Okay. Okay. Ready, Freddy? Come here. Oh, there we go. Oh, so good. Okay, let me just deal with the little, little sausage. Good boy. That's better, I'm all fresh. Good boy, she go downstairs. Freddy's feeling fresh. Go on then. Go have a little run around outside. <gasps> go on, go. Yeah. I'm feeling good. Oh. <laughs> you feeling fresh? Woo. Good boy. Well done. You did so well. You did so well. So Freddie's just woken up um, and I'm going to try the harness on that I got him 
um, to see, yeah, and then to see if it fits. And then probably take him back to my mum's um, and then just introduce him to the dogs individually. <gasps> Thirsty boy! But yeah, I don't, I'm really scared to put him in a car again after the travel, but he'll be okay because it's only five minutes away. Show everyone your harness, Freddy! Yeah, look at that! Sexy! Good boy. It's okay. It's just for travelling. Good boy. You're a natural, Fred. Should we go see your friends? Welcome to Paradise, Freddy. <laughs> this is your second home. <laughs> Good, your little tail's wagging. Do you like her? <laughs> Isn't she nice? Um, so I've just had some parcels arrive and as Freddy's making friends. I thought I'd open them. Um, one I ordered from Etsy. Oh, it's so cute as well. It's come with a little handwritten card. So this is for my office. Um, it's gonna be tiny. Oh, 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 he's done well. Oh. You know when you order something and you don't check the size and the photo, in your head you're like, it's gonna be this size. I did that. I did that. It's tiny. I mean, it's great, it's cute, and I love it. But it's, do you like how when I was unwrapping it, I was like, oh, it's so small, I was trying to be all positive. But no, I genuinely thought it was gonna be bigger, but it's really cute. It's really cute. I like it. You grow, girl. Next up, I have no idea what this is. Oh! It's little green. I already ordered the paint. Whoa, sorry kids. Um, so it's the colour chart for little green, which will be really good when I actually want to buy more paint. Oh my goodness. Oh my, God. I feel so adulty, you know? I feel like I've got my fur baby, which is like having a child. Got a colour chart, a miniature plant. Life is good. And I'm pretty sure I know who this is. Yeah, I've got the cheese knife out. This is famous for my un un unpacking. Yeah, unpacking videos. Everyone's like, I love that you use a cheese knife. So I'm pretty sure this is from Honest Riders, which is a um, UK company. I'm all about at the moment, I'm all about supporting like local businesses. Um, as well, it's so nice because you get to know like the owners. Oh, hold on, let me get into it. Okay, so um, I recently worked with Honest Riders on a post. Um, it's about a sustainability challenge that they're doing. And basically you pick two things um, off each section that you're gonna change. Uh, and um, yeah, so I did that with them. And they said they were gonna send me some of the new horse soap. Um, because I said that I wanted to change my horse shampoo to one that's more sustainable, better for the planet. So they've sent me this. <gasps> How gorgeous is this? It's horse soap. Um, and I can't even tell you how nice it smells. Oh, really good. And then they've also sent me something else, which I haven't opened yet. And I'm gonna open it. Hold on, mum. Hold on. Let me just, let me just, let me just film this. Two seconds. Sorry. And then they have sent me, wow! A jumper, thank you so much. Mm. You look Body like me. In my lounge. Ooh. Sprout. Lulu, don't get involved. <laughs> I think they'll be all right. She's thinking about it. Oh my God, they'd make a really cute couple, wouldn't they? Both hairy little eyebrows. Sprout. No, they're all right. Let them figure it out. 
Okay guys, so the next bit of the vlog, I'm just pre-warning you, get a tissue, because I cried editing it. Um, but before I do that, because I wanted to just finish it on that because it's such a beautiful um, bit of video. I just want to say a massive thank you to Angel Watch Rescue in Romania. That is where this little one came from um, and they saved his life and um also chappy travel for getting him over here on such a long journey and looking after him keeping him um healthy and safe and oh i just want to thank you guys so much for the amazing um things that you are doing in the world it makes such a big difference to these dogs lives and to um the people you bring them to he's made a massive difference to my life already um, so yeah, the video I'm going to show you is uh, from the evening on, from what the vlog you just watched, um, and then the next few days of him being here. So today it is Monday and he's been here since Friday night. Um, the last video I took was this afternoon before I brought him home, um, and you'll just see the difference in him already. So uh, yeah, enjoy. I've been pushing away Everybody I love I don't know what to do Need a sign from above I just want to be somebody who knows Who knows how to behave But I'm not even close won't you save, 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 save me? Won't you save, 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 save me? I am out here alone Cause there's nobody left I need someone to talk to Get this pain on my chest All the bad things I've done And the people I've hurt Wanna take that part of me And leave it in the dirt Won't you save, 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 save me Won't you save, 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 save me You save, 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 save me Oh, save me Save, save me Oh, I've been trapped in this darkness For far too long now Wanna tear down the curtains Let the sun shine in 